All right, on number 11, we're going to have to distribute the 6. So we got a 12x plus 60. Uh, you could combine like terms at this point if you wanted to, the 4x and the 8x. But you don't necessarily have to. All right. Oh, wow, that's, that's done. We are finished. If you wanted to, you could continue, though, if you chose. You'd subtract 12x from both sides. And that would give you a 0x. I'm going to 60 equals 0x plus 60. <clears throat> then would subtract 60 from both sides. And you'd get 0 equals 0x. Zero so this goes back to the question. What value, the x, times 0 will give us 0? Anything will. So as it turns out, x equals all real numbers. So how many solutions are there? Infinite, Infinite solutions. Yep, there are an infinite number of solutions, and x can be any real number.